Hey guys, it's KJ48, and welcome back to my Hyperion Galaxy Survival Let's Play. This is episode 2. And um, I'm just sitting here at my escape pod. I uh, ran over from my base to the escape pod, and I was doing some crafting, and um, everything stopped. And I'm like, what is going on? Um, why did everything stop? So, everything stopped because I ran out of fuel. Now, I did make some fuel, thank God. I don't know what you're supposed to do if you run out of fuel and you didn't make fuel packs. Um, you might be screwed. So, make sure you make those fuel packs, guys. And I'm just gonna load this sucker up. With fuel packs. Make sure you don't put all your fuel packs in there. You wanna have some backups just in case. Um, you can see right down the bottom left-hand side, too, my oxygen is getting low. So, remember, I put oxygen tanks in the, um... I put oxygen bottles in the oxygen tank. Um, so right there is the oxygen station. You just walk up to that and check out my oxygen. All right, fresh, fresh oxygen. Now, I think you, you use both bottles for that, so that's interesting. Uh, I'm not gonna put bottles in there until I actually use it, though. All right, so let's see where we are on the crafting station. Um, it's still making iron ingots, you know what? Um, it's gonna be done with iron ingots in a second because there's no more iron ore. And now I set up a bunch of cables, metal components, and electronics to craft. Because the next item we're going to be making right here is going to be... Uh, da, 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 fuel tank. Okay. So you need two things for... Um, you need two things to run your base. Um, you need two items to power your base. You need small generator. Oh, and by the way, if you look on the right hand... Alright, this is... This is going to be a problem because these things uh, keep going out. If you look on the right-hand side when I mouse over the small generator, um, right by the word small generator, CV and BA. Now, the Vs are vehicles. I'm not sure what a CV is. Um, I know there's small vehicles, ground vehicles, and BA is base. So basically, um, you want to make sure you craft the right thing for what you're doing. I'm going to be making this for a base. BA is base, so we are okay. Uh, same thing right here. Small fuel tank, BA is base, we are okay. So we're also going to need more metal components, capacitor device, reactor core. Uh, uh, see, this is this is where it becomes a bit of a problem because um, I forget what I need. I know I said reactor core. So we're going to need motors, pipes. We're going to need some more pipes. Let's go ahead and make 10 more pipes. Uh, we're going to need motors and electronics. So right here is electronics. 10 more of those. Uh, motor. I don't know how many of those we're going to need. Let's just make a couple. <laughs> I usually just I usually make more stuff than I need just so I could, I have it. Uh, so that's how the crafting works. And I'm going to uh, I'm going to cut this part out because this is I think what they need to do is when you're mousing over an item, you see that little oxygen station like window on the right hand side of the screen. You should be able to make that stay there. You know, like just have it stay there. And that way, if I wanted to make if I wanted to make a small generator, I could keep the window up, maybe even drag it over to here, and then see what I need. That way, when I go to the components tab, it would be all the easier. Again, pre-alpha, guys. Let's not, you know, let's not forget that. So, all right, motors and pipes. So, that's good. Okay, so I'm going to craft all this stuff, and I'll come back when it's done. Okay, guys, it's becoming daytime, and uh, this is, you know, I'm doing my crafting thing. Uh, so, what I'm going to do is I'm going to let some of this stuff craft. And I'm going to set that up because I need the computer. That should be good. Um, we are going to go ahead and get ourselves some Promethium deposit uh, for more power cells. Um, so there's going to be... I'm just. I'm not going to bother trying to surprise you. There's going to be a little guy over here who's going to try and fight me. Um, I'm not sure what it is. It kind of looks a little bit like a scorpion. You'll see. It's kind of weird looking. kind of reminds me of scorpions. Probably because I've been playing a lot of Ark lately. But um, you'll see. And then we'll get some Promethium, uh, and then we'll turn that into Promethium pellets and turn that into into energy. All right. Um, be careful. I discovered a new resource. There he is. Now, he's he must spawn and, like, know I'm here because I think this is, like, the game teaching you, teaching you combat. So they know you're going to come for Promethium pellets first, first and foremost. And they want to teach you combat, you know, let you know that there are some hostile beings on this planet. So, um, we'll fight this dude. Yeah. Oh, brah. What's up? By the way, he can poison you. That's probably why they give you the, um, the an an antidote pills. Alright, you come over to him. You can loot him. He's got alien parts. It's fine. Yeah, man, that thing's creepy looking. That's what I'm saying, man. Freaky ass thing. Freaky ass aliens. Welcome to Earth. No, this isn't really Earth, but you get the idea. And yes, that was a terrible movie, but that's okay. Guilty pleasure. 
All right, so we're looking for that Prometh Prometheum. Uh, I think right here is probably a good place to dig. All right, this is rock, and there's the Prometheum. This stuff looks good, doesn't it? Much better than Illyrium. I mean, not Illyrium. What am I thinking? Not Illyrium. Um, what's the stuff you mine in, in uh, Space Engineers? Uh, darn it, I can't believe I can't remember it. It's like a real compound. I forget the name of it. Although this might be too, for all I know. Um... What am I looking? Uh, it's a radioactive. Darn it, I can't think of what you use for power in space engineers. Illyrium is what you use for power in, uh, in XCOM. <laughs> Alright, so. There we go. Remember, you gotta pick it up. Remember, like, figuring out to pick it up, like, I didn't think you had to pick it up when I first started playing. And that kind of blew my mind. I was like, why am I not getting my materials? And we are out of ammo. That's fine. Show you how to make some ammo cartridges. Is that it? Okay. Very good, very good. Alright, let's use the jetpack. That's what the jetpack's for. Not a big fan of the jetpack. It feels kind of weak. It doesn't really, like... It, it doesn't really give you that much of a boost, to be honest. So, But it, it get me out of that hole, so maybe I shouldn't complain. Um, you can only have uh, 10 ammo in a clip on this gun, but uh, you do have more ammo in your... Inventory, it would be nice if it showed you the ammo in your inventory. Um, again, pre-alpha. That will come, I'm sure, eventually. Ah, oh, man, I'm still... Uh... Uranium. That's what you get in Space Engineers. Illyrium? Really? Uranium? Well, it's a... Um, a, a, I am. So, but... Oh, okay, you hear that heartbeat? That's because my stamina ran out. So let's turn on the jetpack. This doesn't help you go faster at all. This is, the jetpack is only good for getting out of holes you've dug yourself into. Which is fine. That's just fine. Um, oh, you know what? I didn't need another ammo for this drill. I actually have more ammo clips. And you can hear I'm reloading it. There's no animation yet, pre-alpha. Uh, so let's go on over here to the crafting side. Alright, so we've made all that stuff. Can we make our thingamabob yet? No, we cannot. We still need the computers and the compa uh, capacitor devices. Um, capacitor? Capacitor? Is that what it was? Yeah, capacitor. Two capacitor, two computer. That's fine. Um, one, two. And com capacitor. Capacitor. Oh, there we go. Alright, so we're gonna need some more cables. Let's make another ten cables. And then we will throw this stuff in here. Somewhere. Um, I'm not sure what alien parts are for. We'll just keep that in our inventory for now. Or, what we can do is... We can put the alien parts in here. Cause I, I don't think we're gonna, I also picked up an egg earlier, and I don't really know what, if that's good for anything. Um, you know what? Uh, no, we're good. We're good. We're good. Yeah, we're looking good on power. Eight oxygen bottles, or you know, we're okay. We're okay. It's just the crafting that's you know taking a bit of time. A bit of time. Maybe we gotta make multiple crafting thingies. All right, capacitor device. Do I need two of these? Yes, I do. Hopefully I have enough for two. Yep, I should. Ten. Uh, yeah, I do. Okay, so that's going to be our small generator. There is a way to game this system. I think I can cheat. Uh, you see that craft time is 70 seconds? I think I have a way to cheat, and I'll show you how. All right, so check this out. I, I did this earlier, but I was, I'm was i not sure if I saw it correctly the way I was supposed to. So... Crafting time on a metal plate is 7 seconds. So what you're going to do is you're going to throw down the metal plate and then wait until it's almost done. 7 seconds. It's good enough. Pause it. Then you come over to the item you really want to craft. Uh, oh, I need more electronics. Darn it. Alright, whatever. We'll do it later. <laughs> more electronics. Alright, 10 will be fine. Just get that out of there. See what happens? It keeps where the crafting thing was. Oh, but look at that. It stopped. It stops, so maybe you can't cheat it. We'll see. We shall see. Let's look around. There is some plants you can pick up here. I'm not going to pick these up uh, because they start going bad once you pick them up, and I'm not. I, I don't. I'm not sh quite sure what I want to do with them uh, or what they're for. So I will not do that just yet. We could go get some copper, but let's let's wait for this crafting. I want to get some of this crafting done. Um. Okay. Is that good enough? That's probably good enough. Okay. Can we make this thing now? 
Yes, we can. Okay, so let's test it. Let's test out this theory. Metal plate. Oh, actually, no, we don't even have to test anything out. This is almost done. So, here we go. Um, small generator. This is supposed to take 70 seconds to craft. Let's see. Wow, that was instant. <laughs> okay, guys. Um, um, Elyon Game Studios. Uh, I just found a problem there uh, where you can cheat the crafting time. So, yeah, yeah. Just oh, You probably already know about it. Okay, so small fuel tank. 28 seconds. Let's see if we can cheat it again. 28 seconds. There's only seven, so... Okay, so there we go. Uh, small fuel tank, okay. So we get rid of this, we put this in there, turn it on. Yeah, that was not 28 seconds. Yeah, that's that's a that's a way you can game this system. So I won't use it. You guys can if you want, but I just figured I'd show it to you. All right, let's get back to our base. And Well, you know what? We don't really need to go to the base because there's no... What is that thing? What is that? Oh, doggy. I think he's angry. Is he on me? No, he doesn't look like he's messing with me. Okay, let's leave him alone. Actually, let's not go to the base just yet. Putting this power on the base doesn't do much for us. We don't really have much to do. Um, so what we're going to do is we are going to craft up. The next thing we're going to want is what what is most important? I think food is definitely most important. Um, in order to make the food, the food stuff, you need to make this thing right here, the large constructor. So we're going to need two motors. So let's go ahead and make two motors. Now, what are the motors? Okay, two. Okay, and then we'll make the constructor. Um, if I have to get into really heavy crafting, I will pause it, the video, but right now this isn't too bad. So I will hold on to it for now. Alright. So we need two of those, right? There we go. Oh, we need electronics. This motor is taking electronics, that's why we need more. Alright, I am actually going to pause the video here. I'm going to craft some stuff. I'll be back. Okay, we've got a bunch of stuff uh, queued up to craft, including the uh, large constructor, so we'll let that do its thing. But I want to show you the disassembling part of this uh, this drill. So this this ship is not doing much for us. Um, so we will take parts of it apart, um, like right here, a thruster. So you just hold down right click, and there you go. Every time you hit it, it takes a piece away. Like, see, this is a perfect block. If you hit it once, it should give me metal plate, let's see. It didn't. What did it give me? Did it give me anything? I wasn't paying attention. I didn't see the rest of this stuff. Let's see what this gives me. Uh, metal components. All right. Um, 83512. 835. Okay, it didn't give me anything. It only gives it to you when it breaks apart. So that's interesting. All right. We, we got to make sure not to break anything really important on the ship because we're still using it. But um, we can start taking it apart. There we go. See? Um, is there anything? Thrusters, I'd imagine, give you more. We probably don't need these inventories. Let's see if this cargo box is giving us anything per hit. Um, 683544. 683544. 683544. Okay, so I thought it gives you one piece per hit, but I guess not. It probably gives you everything once you've destroyed it. 35... No, 6835... Wait, did that not give me anything? I'm thinking I'm not getting anything. Hold on. I'm, I'm curious now. Now, if these things are going to give us anything, it's not going to give us a motor. It's going to give us either electronic... It's going to give us one of these five. So 683544. Oh, this has got stuff in it. Six, eight, three, five, forty-four. Six, eight, three, five, forty-four. I'm not sure if I'm missing something here, guys, but you're supposed to get stuff back. Um, let me take another look at the gun. Um, right mouse bump is remove block. So it says remove block. It doesn't say you get this stuff back. <coughs> when I was doing this um, before, like a, like a couple weeks ago, I'm pretty sure I was getting stuff back. Um, if anyone is familiar with this game, let me know if I'm doing something wrong, because I thought I was supposed to be able to get stuff back. But, maybe not. Alright, well, in that case, then there's no point There's no point in take, turning apart the ship. Um, let's put some oxygen things in here. Just one for now. See how much that gives us. 
Okay. All right. That's fine. That's fine. You don't want to use oxygen tanks or oxygen bottles when you when you only need a little bit of oxygen because I think even if you only need a little bit of oxygen, it uses all of the oxygen bottle. So, all right. Let's see how we're doing with the crafting. All right. Doing good. We need that. That's fine. Um, let's go ahead and take our constructor. And then what we're going to do is we are going to set up... We're making these uh, metal plates because we want to make a lot more of these blocks. Like a hundred. Although it takes two metal plates, so we probably don't have enough, but that's okay. It'll make... It'll it'll use the amount of metal plates that is needed for that hundred. That is fine. Uh, let's go... Let's go uh, mine some stuff. We're going to hit that copper deposit because that's going to take a while. Alright. I'm not happy with this pistol. I want to get a rifle. Uh, that'll probably be one of my uh, next next big priorities uh, because you know the first night we didn't get attacked by anything I'm kind of surprised when I first played this there was stuff the first night I think maybe it wasn't the first night maybe maybe I'm just m misremembering that but um, we, we're gonna need a rifle we're gonna need one soon all right so we are almost out of stamina so let's hit the jetpack and get up this mountain how oh, this jetpack is not I hope you can um you could build stuff to make your jetpack better because this jetpack is weak sauce it really is. I know there's a way to go to third person. I just don't know how. All right, here we are. Copper deposit. I don't think this copper deposit was here last time I played either. So these developers have been quite active. They've been quite active. That's for damn sure. Okay, copper. Here we come. Eventually. We'll get there. No, no. Come on, jetpack. Come on, you useless jetpack. Here we are. Here's the copper. Hey, come to Papa. Copper's used for circuitry, uh, mostly for wires. And, you know, there's tons of wires in circuitry. So, that's pretty much what copper's used for. I might be knocking out too much stone at once. I don't know. Like,. I'm assuming if you knock out a certain amount of stone, um, the stone you've already knocked out will... Man, that's a lot of copper deposits. Why is there two? It looks like there's another one off in the distance. That's interesting. Um, I'm not sure how many rocks you can have on the ground before the game starts deleting rocks you've already, cut, you've already mined. So... Um, I don't think I've ever gotten to a point where they've deleted rocks, though, but... I guess I wouldn't know. It is possible. So, you know, you, you basically mine up as much as you feel comfortable. And when you think that you've got a lot of copper on the ground, or whatever you're mining, um, stop mining and pick it up. There we go. Looks like it's starting to get dark, so we will uh, just pick these up and get home. Come on. Come on, you can do it. Is that all of them? Alright, there we go. Might be missing a couple. It's not the end of the world, though, guys. Uh, you can take falling damage, so be careful. Food. Okay, food is blinking red. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to come down here. See that emergency ration? Press 9. And munch down. Look at that. It gave me the stamina back, too. Did my oxygen go up? I couldn't tell. I wasn't paying attention. All right, whatever. Let's um, turn off the jetpack and sprint home. There's that iron deposit. We're going to need quite a bit of iron, so... Alright, I'll be right back. Okay, sorry about that. Had a call. Alright. So, what the hell is that? That thing might be evil. Oh, that looks evil. Let's get home. We've got this little dinky-ass pistol. I should have made a rifle. Oh, he might be on me. Oh god, there's another one. This is what I was talking about. They, basically, when I played, these guys were like dinosaurs, but they changed the uh, skins. The dinosaurs were always a, just a you know a placeholder. They were never meant to be uh, anything permanent. No, they're not on me. All right, cool. Thank God. Let's get a rifle. I think number one priority before we even do anything more with the base is a high-powered rifle. All right. Oh, easy there, Chief. He's coming right at me, too. Hold on. All right, so... Uh, let's just let that craft as we look up rifle. Okay, so we've got the drill. We already have the drill. We've got a filler tool. I don't know what that is. Repair tool. That's very good. Here we go. Assault rifle. Or a shotgun. I'm going to go with the assault rifle. So we need five metal components. Let's just get rid of this stuff. Five metal components. Five metal components. Five metal components. 
Uh, metal components? Okay, five. One, two, three, four, five. Go. Go, go, go! Do I have what else, whatever else I need for it? Yes. I'm going to need the ammo as well. I believe it takes the... This uh, 6.8 millimeter, which means we're going to need metal pieces. Assault rifle. Then we're going to need metal pieces. I don't know what metal pieces are. I don't think I've ever remember seeing those. Metal pieces? Oh, look at that. Okay. All right, well, let's make 10 of those. Do I, do I need a lot of those, or is that for each bullet? Five metal pieces for each bullet and magnesium powder. Uh, okay. Okay, so we only have a certain amount of magnesium powder. We can always go mine that, though. That's not a problem. Let's, uh, what did I say, five? So five, two magnesium powder, that's 10. So we're gonna need 50 of the metal pieces. 50 metal pieces. And I want all of them. All right, now when that's done, we will go ahead and just start making these blocks, as many as we can. And there we go. This is a lot of slow crafting. It's part of the game, guys. I wanna show you, you know, all parts of the game. But I don't have to make you sit through it. Um, I'm gonna actually call this video here because we are coming towards the end. Next video, we will have our gun and we will uh, start working on expanding the base. So that's gonna be it for episode two. We'll see you next time for episode three. Till then, take it easy.